welcome to easy electronics so this video is a recruitment news for samir so there is a recruitment from samir which is society for applied microwave electronics engineering and research so this samir is working in iit mumbai and there is a recruitment for the post of scientist c and scientist b the number of post or the vacancy details is for scientist b post there is 28 vacancies and for scientist C post, there is two vacancies. First, we are going to see the salary details. For scientist C post, the salary ranges from 67,700 to 208,700. And for scientist B, the salary is in the range of 56,100 to 177,500. So the salary is a very decent or a high package offering. Now let's see the position or the qualification details. So, the first one is for scientist C post. There are two vacancies and the recruitment is happening for microwave and RF section. The qualification, the essential qualification they are saying is B, B tech or ME, M tech in EC or in the microwave and electronics field. And they are also asking an experience of four years in the RF and microwave field and the related areas. And also if you have a PhD, then there is that is a desirable qualification. Okay, so that is the details for scientist C. For scientist C post, they are asking for an experience. Now for the second uh, post, which is scientist B, there are various sub uh, categories also. For scientist B for various uh, areas or for various fields they are calling for. The first one is scientist B for microwave and RF section. There are six vacancies in that particular section for scientist B. The qualification, the essential qualification is B, B tech, ME, M tech. And they are not asking experience, but if you have experience, then that is a desirable qualification. Okay. Then the third one is again for scientist B for electronics, there is 17 vacancies. The essential qualification is B, B tech, ME, M tech and it is desirable or the desirable uh, qualification is that you should have an experience in DSP, MATLAB, Sibling and the related areas. So that is the third post details. The fourth post is again for scientist B for physics section. There are three vacancies. The essential qualification is MSc Physics and if you have a PhD then there, that is a desirable qualification. Okay, so that is the fourth one. Fifth one again scientist B for radiological physics. There is one post. You should have a master's in medical physics or radiology. Again, if you have a PhD then that is again a desirable qualification. The sixth one for again scientist B and the field is atmospheric science. So you should have a B, B tech or ME, M tech in atmospheric science engineering. Okay. So these are the post and the qualification details. As per the notification, only the scientist C post, they are asking for experience. This four year experience is required. And for all the other posts, they are just saying that if you have an experience in this desirable, that is in this area, then that is a desirable qualification. Okay. So that is all about the post details. Now the age limit is for scientist B, the maximum age limit for general category is 35 years. For scientist C, maximum age limit is 40 years and there is age relaxation for SCST and other reserved categories. Okay. Now the fees details is for general, the fees is 400 rupees for SCST, disabled person and for women candidates. There is only 200 rupees fees. So if you want to have a detailed uh, look into the notification, I'm going to give that in the description. Okay. So you can uh, find it over the, in the description, you can find that in the total notification of this Samir. Okay. Next, the last date for application is 16th of September. Also, the selection process, they are uh, given in detail. The selection process is consisting of written test and interview. The written test is for three hours. And the locations in which the test is going to happen is Mumbai, Chennai and also in Kolkata. The posting will be in Mumbai IIT. Okay. And the interview will be there from the uh, for the people who are passing the written test. So that is all about the selection process which is consisting of a written test and an interview. 
Okay, so these are the most uh, important details from the SME recruitment. So if you have all these qualifications and if you think that you can apply for this post, then please do apply for it as soon as possible because you cannot find a lot of recruitments happening in this Corona time. Okay, so please do apply for this post if you have other all, the all essential qualifications. And if you found the video useful, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and keep on watching.